8 August 2018. This four men old, me kuni be? Just came in to Topaya Vets. It was referred by a pet shop. The complaint was the right hind leg. It's not standing, not putting on weight on the right hind leg. As you can see, can you walk? You put on, hold him up and see. Put on four legs, no, I mean standing. Can you walk? Push a bit. Turn the turn this way. Turn turn all the way, yeah. Turn turn all the way. I see. Some, I saw him walking just now, but there he can. Walk. Let's see. See where he can walk. You see his leg keep on uh, deviating outwards. So there is a bound to be a fracture. Otherwise, the leg should be forward. Like the left leg, you see the left leg is forward, the left leg is pointing forward, that is the normal way, this leg is deviated outwards, huh? you see the front leg is okay, now when we turn the, we turn the rabbit, uh, the guinea pig, you can see, stand up, stand on the four, four two legs, just stand up, no, stand up first, no, two legs, uh, two legs, you can see, the normal leg is the left leg, left hind leg, is pointing forwards and the right hind leg is deviating outwards out means out, outwards laterally yeah. so there is something wrong okay put it down again let's see can he walk now he can't really walk point the leg again yeah so there's a fracture okay so now i will palpate it see any pain Put to the put to the side view. Uh, you can see. Now there seems to be some swelling here. There's some pain. Ah, uh, the pain is there. The distal tibia. Am I? So we roughly we know. You can feel that. This part is fractured. You can feel the turning. Compared to this one, this one is very straight. Uh. This one, the hock is very straight. You see, even. Uh, and there's no pain. The pain is here and there's a swelling on the distal femur. This part is swollen. Uh, the pain is here. Okay, so now we look at the x-ray. You put the x-ray down here and we see x-ray pointing at no straight. Okay, we look at the x-ray. See the lateral view, enlarge the x-ray a bit. The oh, tibia side here. Yeah. Okay. So I point the arrows. It shows, it shows a bit brighter, it shows, uh, I can't see from here, no it's too, too dark, ah, here can, it shows that the fracture is at the distal tibia near the hock joint, and uh, you can see very clearly, and that was where the pain is, when I felt the leg, and there's a swelling there, and uh, compared to the left leg, which is the normal one, no, no, the, the same same lateral view, same lateral view compared to the left leg. No, the left hock. You see, there's no fracture. When there's no fracture, the whole joint is very nicely placed. You see, point the hock joint. Hock joint is there. Yeah, okay. Compared to this one, the fractured one, you can see the arrow is where the bone breaks. Both sides, huh? uh, the left side also, I mean the lowest side. And so there's a confirmed fracture of the tibia. Tibia is the lower leg, long bone, huh? tibia. And, uh, okay, point, point the tibia. My assistant will point to you the tibia. Tibia, you can, you can uh, turn it down. Tibia is there, yeah. Tibia, this is the bone of the tibia. Where, where's the tibia? Tibia is here, here, this part. This whole bone is a tibia. Now where's the hock? The hock is on, uh, there's a hock. Where's the fractured area, the swelling? Uh, actually you can see uh, that there is a fractured area and you can compare to this leg, it's not swollen there. Where's the tibia? Hold, hold the leg. You can see the normal leg, the left leg. Okay, where's the hock? Hock is there. Mm. But you can see it's very thin, it's, it's not swollen. Eh? Okay, show the hawk again. 
how I say the tibia. The tibia is the is the bone there, uh, but tibia and hock area uh, is not swollen. They look at this side, it's definitely quite fat here. See, swollen. Uh. So even without x ray, you can tell that uh, there's, there's likely a fracture because you can feel the, 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 the pain. Uh. Okay, so now we look at the other view the ventral dorsal view or the x ray. You need to take two views uh, so that you can see. Okay, we look at the fracture area again. Uh, enlarge it a bit. Mm, you can see uh, the tibia has already gone downwards there. The tibia, like give me the thing. The, now the tibia is gone down. Normally the tibia should be up here. Okay, just point our video again. After we see the okay the fracture here and the other side also where the tibia has dropped. No, just the middle side. Uh, that's why I show you the tibia has gone downwards. Uh, that's already fractured. Yeah. Okay, compared to the normal leg. Normal leg. Uh, no, I mean enlarge it, the normal leg. The tibia again. And uh, you see it's very nicely. Uh, the hot joint. Uh, there, uh, there's a joint here. Then compared to the other one, there's a swelling. Don't put down, uh, just, just push to the side. And latch it. You can see this swollen. Yeah. You can see the fracture. The arrow shows the break in the bone. Do you see? Yeah. Uh, okay. Now I close up. There's a fibula, the small bone. Uh, like chopstick, like that. It's, it's broken as well. But the main problem is the tibia. Show the tibia. And that is where the fracture is. So, okay. That's it. Yeah. Okay, so we stop now and the treatment is, it depends on what the vet will recommend.